I'm your host, Tanya Grady, a.k.a. Grady Girl. On today's show, we are featuring a fabulous program called Chinusu Bakari. It's a rites to passage program that helps personally to develop our young black males from ages 8 to 18. This program is fabulous. I hadn't heard about it, but as soon as I did, I wanted to come out and feature them on the Red Room because I want to make sure you know about them. and that these young men are very intelligent, these young men are very forward thinking, they're very thirsty for knowledge. Well, I was, when I was young, my father was not there for me. I was three years old and he was sick. And he died at the age, when I was five, he died at the age of 24. And I didn't have no male um, father figure in my life, so my mother introduced me to Janusa Bakari and it changed my life. Um, also, I didn't have a father in my household and um, I really didn't want to go at first, but my mom told me I had to go, and I needed a male figure in my life, so I learned new things, and now I'm here now. Same. Um, <clears throat> I didn't have my father in my life. Um, um, my mom just wanted me to get out the house and um, don't focus on video games and all that. She wanted me to experience more and um, bond with other um, young men. I had a father. But he wasn't like there for me. He wasn't there. So I just joined Chinoso and they like all there for me. So what we try to do is just be intentional about what we try to do. We try to make sure that our, our young men see from men mm -hmm. what, um, what is needed to be um, to done to be successful in the future. Um, we show that men can love each other. Yes. Men can hug each other. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes we got to give a little tough love as well, mm -hmm. but, love, but it's still love. And long as they know it's coming from the right place, and sometimes they just need a little nudge to show that yeah, yeah, you are successful, you are intelligent, you are smart, you are handsome. Because so many times we are told what we're not. Mm -hmm. So it just sometimes we need to have people just to tell them who we are. Reinforcement. Right? Yes. yes. One of the things that I got from the young men that I interviewed, mostly all of them said, I asked them what was the best part of the program. Mostly all of them said the brotherhood. So I think that's awesome as well because a lot of times you see these young males and they're fighting and hating on each other. So when you see these young kids and they're loving each other and you know being kind of like their brother's keeper and you guys are teaching them that, there's no way that they can lose in the future. This is a win-win. Right, that's all part of what we try to do as a developed community. Um, tonight, welcome to the Red Room, huh? Welcome to the Red Room tonight. Welcome to the Red Room, huh?